So now I'm going to have a look in start pick and stop pick. So let's say you want to know what's the elevation of this reflector here. You can just click this position and the Y position here is going to give you the information about the elevation. In that case, it's 1,290 meters um, of elevation. Um, so to export this information, you can use a start pick and stop pick. And even better, you can track this reflector by clicking start pick and then using the left click of your mouse here and you can click all over along this profile oh that's also important if you misclick let's say here and you want to erase this you can just click in and do and finish striking this reflector so now you can click in stop pick and I'm gonna create a folder here I'll reflector I'm going to save this information inside this folder and I'm going to call this reflector one and the output of this it's going to be a text file with x, y and z information if you had a three dimensional topographic correction or a 2D text file if you only use it um, a two dimensional topographic correction. And that can be really useful to not only track uh, reflectors but also to create surface. GPRPI has an option that you can interpolate different reflectors to create surface, and there is a video about this as well.